Civil Society Constitution Agenda held their first meeting with the public on 2nd March 2017 in Matero after the Declaration of Rights failed to succeed. A constitution referendum was held alongside 2016 general elections on 11th August in Zambia, a move said to have been designed to reduce costs. Six and its board members, Bishop John Mambo, Sarah Longwe, Father Luonde, McDonald Chipenzi, to mention very few, invited 15 organizations, governmental and non-governmental, the press, and members of the public. But where was Siska during the 2016 general elections? Mr. Chipenzi briefly explains. The referendum was embedded in the general elections. And we couldn't perhaps be active at that particular time because the whole process was also uh, politically charged. And after the elections, it was thought that we need to regroup and start the agenda because the mission had not yet been accomplished. The mission of having a people-driven constitution, more especially that the expanded Bill of Rights was not included in the amended constitution, means that we, the Zambian people, still have work to do. And that work is to ensure that the expanded Bill of Rights are put in the amended constitution. And Siska's vice chairperson, Pamela Chisanga, says the referendum failed to succeed due to a number of factors. On a different date, the government, on the other hand, through the Information and Broadcasting Minister, had this to say. If we had come out to vote in the referendum, some of these issues that we are looking for addressed right now would have been addressed. This government is very committed to ensuring that all these bills go through. But a referendum would be a bit expensive for the country right now, especially that we are having financial challenges. What the president has said is that, please, can we find another cheaper means of ensuring that we go back to the drawing board so that all these issues are addressed once and for all. And that does not mean that the government is dodging. It is this government that stood in the last general election on its platform saying people have to come out and you need to vote in the referendum. But was there enough sensitization done for the people to know what was contained in the referendum? Nchimunya Chibala reporting for Mama Sosa in Lusaka.